Hello so guys, today I'm going to show you how you can connect your controller with your Xbox Series S, X or the Xbox One. So first of all guys, what you need to do is the first way if you have like a problem, if you cannot do this, so once you hold on and make sure that your, uh, your controller is actually on before you actually do this. And once you see the uh, light blinking, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and connect it to your controller. So I'm going to just take it from this one. Right, and let's plug it in. Ah. All right, it should now connect, like you see. So this is the quickest way how you can connect it, guys. And then once you plug it out, you can just play. But let's just say that we have it again, just to show it to you guys. It just directly connects without no issue, and you can just basically play it. So yeah. Now let's go back on here. So now I'm gonna show you guys how you can play even without a uh, charger. I mean, not a charger, but I mean a battery. So let's just say that you have no batteries at all, right? It still works. All you have to do is just plug it in like this. And now you can just play. So you don't even need batteries actually, but it's gonna be a lot better if you do need it, like get it. So you can play wirelessly, but with this, you can also just play. So no problem at all. And is there something else? Yeah, this is how you can basically turn on your controller and also connect your controller with your Xbox. And I would say nothing else. <laughs> also guys, if you are trying to uh, connect wirelessly and you have a problem with that, make sure that your batteries are right. So make sure that it's plus and then minus it's the right like that you basically place it in and also um, that it's not like uh, stuck so what you can do for example is get it out like this like do something like this do the other one like this and then try to plug it back in so yeah this was the video guys i hope you enjoyed it please leave a like subscribe and take care